up guys? This is Raymond Martin by McKinney. Shaved again. Today, I want to talk about power, wisdom, courage. You know, from the Legend of Zelda series, one of the games I, some of the games I used to play was that, um, some of the games I used to play were Link's Awakening, Oracle Seasons, Ages, the Minish Cap, the Minish Cap, those are some of the games I, I really like. Those are probably some of my favorites. But this is where I'm coming with when it comes to manifesting. Wisdom. Recognizing that nothing is impossible to you. That all possibilities exist within inside you. All possibilities, all viewpoints exist within you guys. Getting different viewpoints of what already is. Directed by your self-narration. Thoughts. Assumptions. The courage is being able to use, to select those viewpoints where it is. The courage to claim things in the being not yet seen as though they were. And the power to faithfully press on, to mentally press on, regardless of external, of what the external world shows. For the external world only reveals to you how you view yourself in relation to it. Directed by yourself, narration, thoughts, assumptions. Your claims, guys. Your claims. Your pa the power to claim or assume things in the being, not yet seen as though they were. And the things not yet seen become seen. That's power itself, guys. You're claiming the evidence in the being moment by moment. That's your faith. In claiming this power in the being. That's when you'll start seeing the evidence. And the evidence itself. Helps to verify your claims. Your self narration. Reveals, your, reveals the objective evidence guys. The objective evidence. Projections or manifestations. And the evidence. The objective evidence. Projections or manifestations. Help to verify. Your self narration. Everything's rendered in your own image, guys. You're getting different viewpoints of what already is. Directed by yourself, narration, thoughts, assumptions. Different viewpoints of what already is, guys. Sick, healthy, poor, rich, non believer, believer, genius, single, married, world class athlete, etc. All viewpoints, all different viewpoints. Of the same life substance, guys. Moment by moment. And they're all determined by your self narration. How you view yourself in relation to the omniverse of all existence. Change your self narration. You can always, the story persists. And here's an, and another thing, too. Claim it. You claim the evidence in the being, and evidence helps to verify your claims, your self-narration. Helps to verify your self-narration, giving you permission to keep persisting the story you tell yourself. The story you keep telling yourself, guys, that's how the world's going to appear to you relative to your observation. And you always have the ability, you always have the choice and ability to change the story at any moment in time. Always live by live by your assumptions, guys. Don't just say that. Live by what you desire. Live by live by your beliefs. Stand firm in them. Don't let the external world sway you. Stand firm in your own beliefs, in your own power to observe your self narration. Always be, it's be focused, be inwardly focused in your power, guys, to observe your self narration. Guys, the eyes, I, I, I've caught myself before. My self narration, like my sub, my physical movements in space time, I recognize, oh man, I wasn't aware of those physical space time movements. And they're all directed by my frame of reference, guys. Direct. They're all determined by my frame of reference directed by self-narration. 
So change your self narration to an empowering story. Tell yourself an empowering story. And you will inevitably experience objective experiences relating to that story. And those objective experiences, again, help to verify your self narration. Proportion. Those objective experiences help to verify your self narration proportionately, giving you permission to keep persisting your own story. So I leave it at this, guys. Always tell yourself an empowering story, even if it seems far off in the moment. If you desire it, tell it to yourself. Tell it to yourself often. Make it a habitual thing. You don't need to get delusional or anything, but just really inwardly within yourself without telling anyone else that you are becoming this person. You are this person. Different viewpoints where already is right here and now, guys. Infinite viewpoints, dimensions, possibilities within yourself here and now. So guys, I hope this video helps. And here's and one more thing. Nothing is impossible to you guys. If I as Iron Body can do this by sharing these messages, you can do it exponentially better. I want you to see what I'm saying to you guys. I don't want you to be limited to my messages. I want you to exceed my messages. Use my messages as a catalyst, but go beyond what I'm saying. This is your life that you give to and take from yourself moment by moment. Use my messages as a catalyst and go beyond what I'm saying to you. Nothing's impossible to you guys. I don't want anyone to say, don't tell me that, not, that something's impossible to you. Because whatever you tell yourself, that's the truth. How have you described yourself in relation to the universe? That's the truth. You can never lie to yourself, guys. You can never lie to yourself. You're always telling yourself the truth. How have you described yourself in relation to the world? That's how it is. That's how it's going to appear to be. So, guys, I hope this video helps. I bless you all and happy manifesting. What will the iron body do? I am the iron body. I've always been master of manifesting. Only my positive thoughts manifest. Bless you all.